Hello everyone and welcome to another Looker Studio tutorial. Today we're going to learn how to use custom colors in Looker Studio and it's extremely easy. All you have to do is to click on an element, scorecard, column chart, pie chart. I'm going to show you how to do it with everything. Then you go on style on the right hand side. Then let's say for the scorecard, now we are on style. We scroll down and we find the label, the color of the font. Then we click here and here it says custom. We're going to click the plus symbol. So once you click the plus symbol, this screen will open up. Two choices, either you just copy paste here the code or you take this bubble and you just move it or you fill in essentially the particulars of your color code. Once you're happy, you click done. That's it. Let's say you want to do the same thing for a column chart. You click here on the column chart. Go on style again on the right hand side, right? And now here, obviously, there are a couple of things you can customize. So let's say you want to customize the color of the, uh, the column here. You click here on color by on the blue color. You click on custom again and you come in. You basically customize your color. Right, so you're happy, you click done. If you want to customize anything else, let's say the grid or whatever, let's say it is, same drill. Pie chart, same drill. Click on style, then let's say we want a single color, but we want it to be custom. We click here, we click the plus symbol, we, are, we play around or we paste the code, then done. That's pretty much it. Same thing with tables also, right? So always you select the element, you go on the right-hand side, you click on style. And then, for example, here, this is the header font color. So we can actually customize it to, to something else. We can change also maybe here to a blue scale. And we select done. Now you can see here the header changed, right? So whatever you want to adjust and format, the drill is always the same. You select the element, you go on style, you find what you want to customize, you click on it, and then you select custom, the plus symbol. And here you have three options. You have the hex code, you have the different style of code here, and you can also play with uh, the bar, and you can also play with the transparency. That's it. If you manage to do it, throw a like to the video, subscribe to the channel. It helps tremendously to create new content and have a great day in any time zone. Thank you, everyone.